Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is BTW First, my name is WTB, and welcome back to another episode of the Money Night Crime Mode. This is episode number 14, I believe. And we are starting off it with a game against Watford, and here is my lineup. And we go into the game right now, and there's only one highlight in this game, which is really annoying. But, but as we are the scoring, top scoring team, 48. And here we go in the 90th minute third. Um, this is my first and only highlight of the game. Whole bass here coming down the left hand side. Cuts back, passes it to Britos. Britos over to Naya. Nyam. Nyam under pressure, clearing it away. Gaia heads it and offside from Dini. Dini was offside. So from the free kick, then small and boots up. Harry Kane heads it to Schneidlin. Schneidlin skips round one, skips round two, three or four, whatever. And uh, <laughs> uh, Kane then gets brought down, and we get ourselves a penalty in the 90th minute. Look at Kane right there. Look at Kane. He's like, "Do you want to punch me? Do you want to punch?" Well, he wasn't happy with that challenge. I wasn't happy with that challenge. It was clearly a penalty, and he was stopping a goal scoring opportunity. Clear goal scoring opportunity. And they got nothing but nothing, literally nothing. But, anyways, Harry Kane, seeing as he's one eyes, decided to step him up for apparently. He shoots and he scores. Yep, and I've got some news coming up. <laughs> Anyway, excuse me. <sighs> Got another one coming, but oh well. Yeah, we have. <laughs> so. Anyway, if I've got another one coming. Nah, hopefully not anyway. Number 13, Harry Kane puts it in for 1 0. And that is in the end, the end of the game. But don't worry, guys, we do in the end go up to match recap because they actually put in highlights that I couldn't really see. First highlight, Harry Kane's shot was well saved there by Gomez. Gomez, Mess, whatever, how you say it. And there, uh, the foul because the shirt tug, you know, and then Shannon dramatically falls over. Anyway, that's Rooney's shot, I do believe, Rooney. Was Rooney even playing this game? I don't know. And then that was Telemans. Telemans, yeah, that shot and then that shot. Telemans is a fair word. Telemans actually has a potential of 19. There's a poor shot by Harry Kane. There. Telemans wins, well that's a very good tackle there, but anyway. Pass it through to whoever that is, I think it's Telemans again. Telemans missed a lot of shots, but he's a really good player, Telemans. I enjoy using him. And anyways guys, in the next episode of the Money Night Comment, we have a full game live, a Capital One Cup final against our bitter rivals. Manchester City, but that's a fantastic free kick by one matter that just um, went wide, and here's the penalty. Kaboom. Goal, that's all. And that is the end of the game. In the end, we do win 1 0, 1 goal to nil, and as we go into a simulated game, I decided to simulate a game. His, I just sorted out my team there for the game against Stoke, which we did in the end simulated. And we. Oh, wait. No, it was Lingard. Lingard was the first with the shots. Anyway, Tina Man's didn't play in the game against Watford, it was Lingard. Lingard, and. Yeah, we do in the end simulate the uh, Stoke game. I was going to play it, but I decided to simulate it. But Herman in, the, Herman in the second minute makes it one goal to nil, then gets injured. Rooney makes it two goals to nil in the 24th minute. Martial in the 35th minute. Rooney misses a penalty in the 42nd. Felipe Anderson makes it 4 0 in the 
fourth minute and Martial final goal of the game in the 70th minute with his second goal of the game and we did in the end win five goals to nil as you can see on the screen right now well it was on the screen but now it's not you know but player injured my it was uh, Herman out for like like two days or something like that whoops anyway we go into the game against uh, here's my lineup I decided just to play Martial the same lineup that just absolutely demolished the only change is now I put the Schneidmare in midfield to save one team that just put up Schneidmare Schneidmare I like saying that Schneidmare in the midfield but anyway go into the game against Bayer 04 in the round of 16 or was it the round of 16 or the round of 32 I don't know probably the round of 32 or the round of 16 what's happening with that anyway we have the no, in the end, it is the round of 16, isn't it? Because we have the quarterfinals and the semi-finals and the final. Two legs in each, except for the final. Anyway, Bio 4 here, straight from kickoff, short of the throw, passing it down to Smalling. Smalling there, all the way across to Damien. Damien, as to matter. As it goes outside, gets tackled by Wendell. Wins a throw in there. Damien with throw passing it to Wayne Rooney. Rooney in it took it a little bit then passed it to Martial. Martial then passed it to Swansteiger. He passed it to Philippe Hansen and the magic that is Philippe Hansen cuts inside and finesses it into the back of the net making it one goal to nail to the Red Devils straight away and Hansen is absolutely fantastic. He is absolutely fantastic. He's a very good signing. Not my best signing. Quentin Carmen was my best signing. Well, all the signings that I actually made in the summer and in January. But it's a fantastic finish. But if T I'm not selling Telemans at all. Telemans is here to stay. No matter how hard. He's here in Man United. He's retiring at Man United. So is Hansen. Unless I decide to sell them along the line of these three years, seasons I'm doing, three seasons I'm doing. If you want me to do more than three seasons, guys, let me know in the comments down below. But here, Philippe Anderson again smashing it into the top corner of the ball over the top from Rooney, I think. And I think the player there was walking off with Schweinsteiger. But Anderson with his second goal of the game makes it two goals now to Manchester United but anyway here in the 74th minute free kick from David De Gea pass it to Chris Smalling Smalling to Luke Shaw Shaw passing it to injured Schweinsteiger I know it's Schweinsteiger but he gets dispossessed he comes here to Bellaroyabi he crosses it in Topak header was cleared but it was deflected by Damian but it came to Kishpilin and he put it into the back of the net to make it two goals to one to United and guys that is coming towards the end of the episode like if you enjoyed subscribe as always and I'll see you guys in my next video which will be a live full game against Man City I'll see you guys later peace